Hey guys, it's Julie here, and welcome to Prankster Dollies episode 4, and we haven't done a Prankster Dollies episode in forever, like it's been such a long time. In the last Prankster Dollies, it was the Super Bowl playoff sort of thing, and me and Emily were about to watch the playoffs, and Marisol disconnected the TV, and we were going insane, and for those of you who didn't even see that Prankster Dollies, you better go check it out. Like, our reactions are, like, hilarious looking back on it now. So today, I'm here for some revenge. Of course, I have to get revenge, so I'm actually going to be pranking Marisol because tonight is her prom night, and she bought this $10,000 dress because she really wants to look super pretty for her prom date. So I'm going to make sure she learns her lesson on not buying $10,000 dresses. Like, really, people, $10,000. Marisol is actually shoe shopping right now for her dress because she's doing a lot of last minute things for prom. So I'm really excited because we do have a lot of time because you know Marisol in her shoes. She can't just go to the shoe store for an hour. It's mainly 10 hours at the shoe store on average every day because she, she can't, she has an issue with fashion people. So this is actually going to be like a little DIY project for revenge. So if you guys want to Get your sisters back for a prank they pulled on you. Here is the perfect DIY. Here is the dress, and I do have to say it's actually really pretty, but it's not $10,000 pretty. So what I'm going to do is completely mess up the dress, make it all wrinkled and dirty, and this is really easy, and it's actually a really fun DIY too. I'm going to be taking the dress and putting it somewhere where she can't really find it but I'm also going to leave like a little piece of the dress out so she will find it and then see it's all ripped and all like wrinkled and stuff and then she will be forced to wear a different dress. So I actually ended up putting the dress under my bed and as you guys could see there are little hints that the dress is under here because part of the bottom of the dress is peeking out. So that's exactly what you're going to want to do, just kind of hide it, but also leave a little piece of the fabric sticking out. But to make this prank a little bit more extreme, I'm going to tell her that I actually returned the dress. And you're going to have to see if she finds out that the dress is under my bed, because then she will go crazy, and she will just be freaking out and wondering why it's there if I returned it, and it's just going to be priceless. Okay, I think you guys are good right here. So as you guys can see, you have a pretty good view of the whole house here so you guys can see all the action and I'm so excited. So Marisol should be home in a couple of minutes. So I'm just gonna be sitting here and acting like nothing happened. Julie, I'm home! And guess what? When I was at Forever 21, I saw the cutest pair of high heels. Like, they had the best shoe selection that I've ever seen. Like, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Oh my god, Julie, you should have been there. They had everything there, and at first I wasn't even going to go in there because I love Francesca's better, but Kit told me to go in there, and it was like heaven for me. Like, their muscle tees are the cutest things ever, and I totally love their booty shorts. And then we went to Froyo World, and guess what? They have the best cookies and cream Froyo ever. I got strawberries on mine, and it tastes delicious. Uh, Marisol, shouldn't you be getting ready for prom? It's almost 5 o'clock. OMG, Julie, you are so right. I'm going to be late, and then Cody's going to think I'm ditching him. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Welcome to my life. Um, Julie? Have you seen my dress anywhere? Huh? What? What do you want? Of course, Julie, I should have known. You would never even help me if my dress was missing, because you don't even care. You're just reading that little magazine in La La Land while your sister is going through a major crisis. I've been the prettiest girl at prom, but now my dress is missing and some burglar probably came in here and took it and... <sighs> oh my god, I'm going to have a nervous breakdown. OMG! I am never going to find my dress. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what's that? Oh god, now I'm even seeing things. <laughs> oh wait, Marisol, are you talking about that blue dress? Yeah, it's like royal blue. Why, have you seen it? 
Oh, I actually returned that because we really needed money in the account and that was $10,000. So sorry, Marisol, but I returned it. I didn't know it was your prom dress. I thought it was one of your Halloween costumes. What? Oh my gosh. I am going to kill you, Julie. Like literally. Julie, that was my prom dress. What do you mean it's a Halloween costume? Are you insane? Supposedly. It's not that big of a deal. Like we have other dresses like this one I'm wearing right now. That's like suitable for prom if you ask me. Sorry, Julie, but the prettiest girl in school is not going to prom in that zebra piece of... Viewer discretion is advised. Might as well just go die in a hole because now I'm not going to be able to go to prom. <laughs> Julie, I seriously hate you. You should have never been brought in this family. Thanks, I appreciate it. Julie, I hate you! Wait a second. That looks like my dress under your bed. What the heck? My precious dress! Oh! oh my gosh, I can't believe it's you! Dressy, is it you? Um... But why in the world was it under your bed? April Fools! What do you mean? April 1st already passed. Why would you be pranking me? Oh my gosh, Julie, if this is a Prankster Dolly's episode, this has gone way too far. What? No, this is no Prankster Dolly's episode. Like, like, why would you even think that? Hmm, where'd you hide the camera this time, Julie? Oh, look, there it is. Hi, YouTube. You enjoyed my heart attack? I bet you laughed the whole time through it. Okay, get out of here, Marisol. I gotta make an outro. If you upload this to YouTube, Julie, I will really get revenge. Like, believe me, I know how to get revenge, and you better be watching out. Thank you guys so much for watching this Prankster Dollies episode. Sorry we haven't been doing many Prankster Dollies. We've just been busy, and we don't have time in our lives to do pranks all the time. Just kidding! Of course we have time. We have no lives. Anyways, I hope you guys liked it, and thumbs up if you're Team Julie. Bye!